hey guys let's see what we are going to do in this video first we will generate an Spring Boot project then we will upload that project to github and we will use then Jenkins make a uh, docker image and we will upload that docker image to docker hub now before starting this video there are some prerequisites like you have installed docker Jenkins in your computer in the first part we will build docker image using freestyle project and in the second part i will use pipeline for making docker image so let's start so now i am in my sts so let's create a new project select spring starter project I'll name it part one. I'll change the name. Let's give it my code book. Take note. Click on finish. Let it complete. Now I'm going to create a Docker file so that uh, Jenkins will use that to create a Docker image. So pick right. Go to new and select file. Name it as Docker file. Finish. Open JDK eight. I'm using Open JDK eight here because my project is running on Java eight. Export zero eight zero. And target my code book dot done. It's the name of my jar file which I'll create after something. Event frequent Jar. Now we name of a jar. Save it. Go to form to view my jar file. That is my photo. Save it. Now let's upload this project to GitHub. Let's click on project. And go to Chrome. Hit that. Type in git command. Git init. Now what it does, it will initialize your project to press all the changes. Now I have to go to the place where this project stored.
select Piston Explorer. And open this dot get ignore file and remove this target file and save it. I remove this code because uh, it will not upload this uh, this but uh, this target folder to the GitHub. Because it uh, it is defined in the git ignore file, so I remove the code. So we upload the file to that. Now 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 let go to active. Let's generate in that file. Right click. Click on go. Maven install. Bit factor, let the refresh it better. Reset. I have my jar file, my code book my jar. Now let's up upload this project to Vidu. And then get to my git. Right, get connect message for first connect first connect enter. Now go to your GitHub account. GitHub. Now create and deposit it. I'll name it make it Click on create deposit list. Now copy this one. Paste here, right click, paste, enter, now copy second command, right click, paste, paste, paste. Enter. Our code is successfully uploaded to the GitHub. And now, now let's go to GitHub and refresh the page. See, our code is there. Let's go on the target file. Our jar is present here. So now let's go to the Jenkins. Java, Jar, it will start my Jenkins server.
Now you can see the engine is fully up and running. Now I'm going to add my Docker credentials to go to man manage anything. Click manage credential global add credentials. This is my Docker of registry username. And now I have to give my password. ID. Good password. Start new item. And in this project, I Part one to create our project. Click OK. To create our project, we have to provide GitHub URL here. Copy, paste it. It. Now I have to give the project to you. Paste it. Here we don't have to provide credentials because our repository is complete. In case your repository is valid, you have to provide credentials here. I'll choose my main branch. Select add build list. Now I'll choose Windows Path command. But if you are using Mac or Linux, then you have to choose execute shell. I'll go with Windows Path command because I'm using Windows. Now I'll prepare for building an image. Box. This is with the name of my Docker registry. I'll name it as my code image. Add again, add the step to the Windows Path channel. Now I have to write a command for pushing that image to the Docker registry. The name of the date Please remember, in case you haven't installed Docker in your window, then this, this command will not work. I have installed Docker in my window, so it will, so let's see, I have installed Docker on it. Type Docker. Now I've installed Docker in my window. Now I have to log out my, my Docker registry.
as you can see, I have no repository or images present here. Now let's go to the entry. Let's try to build this image. As you can see, loading the repository from the Git. Now it's pushing the image to Docker very quickly. As you can see, upload of my image to Docker very quickly. So let's see whether the image is successfully uploaded to Docker very quickly. This image is my code book image, which was uploaded in a few seconds ago. Let's build this successful. Now, if you like the video, you hit the subscribe button. And press the bell icon.